Hello and welcome to Sustainability YXE. My name is Kai and I would like to begin by acknowledging that we are on Treaty 6 territory, the homeland of the Métis. Now, this month we are going to be doing the first part of our two-part series. Next month we will be crocheting plastic yarn into plastic bags. But before we can do that, we need to make our plastic yarn. So for that, you are going to need as many plastic bags, as many plastic grocery store bags as you can get, and then a pair of scissors. And what we're going to end up with is something that looks a little bit like this. It's a ball of plastic yarn. And it's fairly simple to do. So let's begin. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to take our bag and I know if you're like me, you like to crumple them up and shove them into other bags. So we need to smooth them out into something a little easier to work with, just like that. And then, once we have that smoothed out in a way we like, we are going to fold it in half, just like that. And then in half again. And then in half one more time. I'm going to smooth it out. And the folds don't have to be perfect, but the closer you can get it, the easier it'll be to cut and the neater your strips will be. Oops. Just like that. And then once you have your bag folded, we're going to take our scissors and we're going to cut off the bottom of the bag or the part where the seam is, just like that. And then we're going to set that aside and we're going to move down to the handle end of the bag and we're going to cut just below the handles because we don't need those either. So what we'll have is just um, a folded piece of bag, just like that, and it'll be open on both ends. Then what we're going to do is we're going to start cutting our strips. So they, these are about half an inch, an inch. Um, it doesn't matter because they kind of stretch out a little bit when you start rolling it into a ball. So we're going to begin that now. Just cut them like this. Awesome. Now once those are cut, you can take your scissors and set those aside because we're not going to need those anymore. And we're going to take our little pieces here and we're going to open them up. And they should be loops like that, just a big loop. We're going to open all of those up and set them aside. Okay, now that we've got all of our loops opened up, the part we need to do next is to loop them together, or to link them together to make our plarn, our plastic yarn. So what we're going to do is we're going to take one of our loops, and another one of our loops, and we're going to take the one here, and we're going to put it through the middle of this one, and then we're going to grab this piece of the same loop like that, and we're going to just pull those like that, and then we'll do that for the rest of them. Fantastic. So, once you've looped everything together, you should have a long bit of yarn, or plastic yarn. And if you don't have a ball of yarn already started, this is where you can start winding yours up. I already have one started, so I'm going to join those two together. So what I'm going to do for that 
is I'm going to take this ball here and I'm going to loop it, the piece coming off of the ball, through my loop and then take the loop over. I might need to take that off. Just over like that. And then we pull that tight just like so. And now what we're going to need to do is we're going to need to wind our yarn around the ball. Just fantastic. There we go. So that's part one of our bag tutorial. Next month on December 16th, we are going to learn how to crochet our plastic yarn into the bag. And what we're going to need for that is a crochet hook. Thank you for coming to Sustainability YXE. We hope to see you next month.